Yo, what's up guys? You got Pokeaim here with uh, some uh, some late news, I want to say. I was on vacation for the past few days, so um, I'm a couple days late on this, but Faramosa is being suspect tested in the OU tier, and I do want to know your thoughts. Uh, it's finally being suspect tested, they're calling it Beauty and the Boost. Uh, speaking of Beast Boost, if you guys want to pick up the um, shirts, hoodies, mugs, or stickers, those are available for just about three more days. They're gone on Thursday, so if you guys want to pick them up, feel free to. Link is down below, but Faramosa is finally being suspect tested. I actually did a video with Blunder on Faramosa, which I will be linking down below in the description. I encourage you to check that out, where we talked about Faramosa, gave our thoughts on it, talked about how it's common, how we feel about it, so I don't want to make this too long, but I, these are generally like little news videos anyway. But, um... Yeah, it's being suspect tested. We already know it has an ama amazing offensive presence, uh, great speed, um, being able to also function as an offensive rapid spinner, functions well with Z-moves like uh, Fighting Focus Blast uh, or Normalium Hyper Beam, which is Breaknet Blitz and all that pummeling, uh, both of which uh, can break through Pokemon that would otherwise check it, uh, such as Toxpex. Toxpex is probably one of the best Pheromosa switchings in the game, having reliable recovery, resisting its stab and most moves that it can come out of it, but uh, Quiver Dance, Boosted, Hyper Beam, uh, Z Hyper Beam can actually deal with Toxpex with a little bit of prior damage. Um, Choice Specs is able to spam Bug Buzz, Ice Beam respectively, Focus Blast just being able to deal with all fat Mons, uh, even Mons like uh, Tapu Fini, which are also pretty decent checks. However, I wouldn't say counters because it's never recovery. I think the best all-around counter is Toxpex, and even then it can sometimes break through that. So, um, yeah, Tapu Fini can fall to a few focus bla uh, excuse me, uh, to a few poison jabs, and also does not have reliable recovery, so it gets worn down. But yeah, Faramos is finally being suspect tested. I do want to know your thoughts. Like I said, I do have a video down below that I did with Blunder. I do want you guys to check out if you have not already seen it, uh, and. Because I just got back from vacation, I'm not going to have any upload today with this, but tomorrow, aka Monday, I say aka, but tomorrow, Monday, I should have a suspect test ladder live where I take on this ladder. Um, but yeah, I, it was, I feel like it was just a matter of time before Faramosa got tested. I do feel like Metagross and Greninja are next, but I do want to know your thoughts. This mon is uh, definitely ridiculous to switch into if you don't have a mon named Toxapex on your team. It's actually the sole reason why, uh, while off, um, what, while offense, or why, excuse me, why offense has to run Toxapex on it as well in order just to deal with this mon. But uh, yeah, it is frail though. I'm not I mean it has 37 defenses on both sides, so pretty, pretty poor and 71 base HP. But just because you can check a mon doesn't mean you can. I beat it without you know taking damage. That's what a check is. A check is an Amon that comes in and counters it. Uh, a counter is a Pokemon like Toxpex that can come in on any set, beat it 1v1, have reliable recovery, whatever. Counter doesn't have to necessarily have reliable reco uh, recovery, but it's supposed to beat the Mon 1v1. Uh, Farabosa has like again like one counter which is Toxpex, and even then, a uh, boosted Quiver Dance, Hyper Beam. Uh, or Normalians, you break that bliss can even deal with that. So, like I said, I do want your thoughts. You can leave them down below. Also, feel free to check out the Beast Boost merchandise. And, um, yeah, I will be linking the Blender video in the description as well as uh, the link to this thread because people are posting their thoughts. Blender actually posted his thoughts. Wow, two paragraphs. Impressed. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys tomorrow with a live on this. So, goodbye, friends.